create a data story, um, your first and most important step is to come up with a proper question or hypothesis you want to prove or disprove. That is sort of the most crucial part where also your specific knowledge as a journalist comes in. If you cover a specific beat, it will be much easier for you to understand what an interesting question or hypothesis is. The next step is is there data to answer that question? That's when most of the ideas you might have had in the first step are going to be shut down because there is simply no data that could help you analyze it. But if you're lucky and you have a good question and you find the data, then you can sort of move on to the next part, which is prepare the data to be analyzed. Understand the data, um, see what variables there are, whether there are missing values, make sure all the spelling of names is correct and um, homogenous. And once you're all set with that, then um, you can move on to the next step, which is the actual analysis part. When we as a team work on data stories, we usually come up with like let's say eight to 20 questions we want to ask to our data set and we actually really document the question and then we do the coding to answer that question. After that we have, a, a, have an overview of our main hypotheses and all the sub questions with the possible answers the data can give us. And then that's the point where we meet with a reporter and sit down, talk through what we found and see what is most interesting from their perspective to go into an article, to talk to experts about or to politicians and to then talk, turn the whole thing into an entire story that maybe features some graphics along with it. <laughs>